All right, guys, so here is a version of the Ikea booth with the straight cap at the legs. Uh, these are the ones that Ikea currently has now. The um, angled ones are not in stock, at least in the U.S. stores. So, as you can see, it is a 8-bin Calyx unit with a 59 inch Linmon tabletop on top of it. I did put four uh, capital legs lifting that up and then took a lac wall shelf and again lifted it up with two capital legs and then um, two of the small lac shelves uh, for the speaker stands um, It's perfect size uh, Width wise Depth wise from front to back it is as well um, As you can see it's a lot deeper than the calyx So I pretty much centered it on top so that I had room in the back um, And as well as room in the front but it was pretty much to balance the weight so that it wasn't uh, swaying too much when I had the support of these calyx legs. Um, this sh these shelves seem a little bit wobbly, especially this one. So what I think I'm gonna have to do is probably install two more capital legs on the back corners to uh, kinda create a tripod a little bit. So, um, these capital legs are not able to be bolted on the bottom. But as you can see, actually, I ran out of long of the short bolts that I had there, so I had to make do. I'll switch that out tomorrow. Um, but pretty much you, this, this centerpiece right here, you lift it up and it removes from this base on the bottom. And then on the plastic on the bottom there, you can drill a hole and then that's where the bolt goes through and then on the bottom I put a washer there to make sure that the uh, bolt wasn't going directly into the wood um, but again it's it's pretty wobbly one I think I'm gonna have to super glue this piece back on because it, it was adhered with some sort of material beforehand but then two I am gonna install another leg here another leg here to kind of create a triangle and then on this as well too it's not as wobbly this shelf but I am going to install another leg in the center in the back um, and then on the bottom here I might just for peace of mind install one more leg right here so um, that ends up being a total of one, two, three, four, five is gonna go here, six, seven, eight is gonna go in the middle, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So it ends up going to end up being a total of 14 legs. They come in four packs, so you're gonna end up having to buy six of those or $12 a piece. Um, I'm sorry, four of those, four. <laughs> My math is wrong for they're twelve dollars a piece um, but all in all I'm pretty happy with the end result it looks off centered because of the angle but it is definitely centered on the top um, this that's just an extra piece I had lying around but uh, for right now my DJ 400 is here I'm going to end up putting the uh, RX2 I just got on here, um, but yeah, and these are the, um, I can't remember what these are called, but they're just little, little bins that pull out. The Calyx unit is pretty cool. You could install um, doors on it if you wanted to. Um, the door, this unit is black, and the doors only come in black brown which is like that color. So, I mean, in this light, you can't really tell the difference, but this kind of has a, like a wood grain, like a fake wood grain on it. 
whereas this is just completely smooth black so I have not put the doors on there because I don't uh, I don't like the mismatch colors I do like the white and black though color scheme um, but again as other people have said with this unit before perfect uh, size for vinyls um, I don't have that I probably don't even have enough to fill up two full bins so that's why I have those little totes on the bottom but that is it